My daddy is on the phone. <laughs> I'm, I'm gonna go and make their breakfast and then we're gonna come back and do our quick introductions to this video. Also, my voice is kind of going, no clue what's going on, but we just vibe in, you know? After a very long time, another video. Things have been very, very slow and fast paced at the same time. Slow in terms of content and fast paced in terms of work. And I'm just at the point right now where I am kind of drained physically, emotionally, creatively, spiritually. <laughs> you know, but we are combating the enemy. We are combating that feeling of self-pity and I believe I'm going through a season for a reason and it is a testing of my faith, it's a testing of my perseverance and my trust and my confidence in God. I'm coming from May into uh, late April, May and now we're almost towards the end of June and I am pushing through. I'm praying, I'm reading my Bible, I'm trusting God. One thing that has been sticking out to me definitely was rest and taking the Sabbath seriously. Never in my 24 years of life have I ever, I, I know what the Sabbath was but I've never actively um, taken it and now I'm feeling the impact <laughs> of not taking that rest seriously. Um, yeah, I, I think, and which is so funny because these past couple of days of my scripture or verses of the day have been centering around the Sabbath and resting and how important it was for God to rest after he created the world and how important that was for him and the reason why he did it is for us as well to realize that we need rest. If he rested after creating the entire world, why shouldn't we rest as we go about our daily tasks and do different things, you know? And so I am actively going to be taking my rest and just getting back to that place of closeness with God. I show up every day. I pray with my Bible, but I feel as if I'm I'm just rushing to do it. I'm not act actively absorbing everything um, as I should. I get burnt out very quickly. I just get tired as well, and I just you know don't feel peace and comfort. I don't feel you know how I usually feel. I'm not as you know joyful and happy as I usually am, and that's because I have not been you know absorbing and just sitting in the presence of God. <coughs> These past few weeks, I've just been pray, read Bible, head out to work. That's all it's been, and that's just not how I operate. I've never operated like that, actually, and this is the hardest I've been hit with this kind of feeling. And um, yeah, this is definitely a season I never want to go here again. <laughs> I am um, actively taking strides to get out of it. I am getting out of it. I am doing it much better, but I still need that rest. Um, this video, I'm just taking you guys along with me for a day. I have not been taking care of my skin again, which is something I do when, when I'm just going, going, going. I neglect myself, my skin, my, my like, I don't work out um, because I'm just so busy at work. By the time I get home, it's just to sleep, bathe, brush my teeth and just go to sleep. And um, I'll read my Bible or try to read my Bible and then go to sleep. So, and I might work from home today and 
not feeling, I'm honestly not feeling like going into the office today because I may work from home and just try to get things together. Yeah. So I'm currently going to brush my teeth, drop off something um, for someone and then come back and then make my breakfast. I wanted to pack my box, my lunch box today, but my breakfast box today, but I may work from here and just try to reset my mind and everything. So I hope you guys, you know, enjoy this video today. So. So I just, something is in my eye, I need to go expir out my eye, but I just finished my skincare video, skincare and everything for the day. I did a deep clean of my entire face because again, I have not done this for a, a very long time, almost two months now. I would just do a quick wash with some soap, put on some sunscreen in the morning and at night I would just wash my face when I shower and then go to bed. So my skin did not like that at all. Like it broke out over here. I've been drinking as much water and different stuff like that. So my skin of course reacts terribly to stuff like that. I am now gonna get myself something to eat. I need to take this band off my head. Ooh, that looks worse anyway. My hair has grown a bit, so I'm grateful for that. It's now down here from all the clipping I've been doing. Today we have macaroni pie with some curry chicken and some steamed butternut and carrot. I'm contemplating having, my hand looks so muscled up, anyway, I'm contemplating having an ice pot my mom made or having an aloe vera juice I bought the other day, but I might leave that for work and just take the ice pot. Great, so I'm gonna get coconut ice pot. It's <laughs> deformed. Towel. Just like so. I love eating with my chopsticks. So, yeah, that is my lunch. I have a social media post to do at 3 o'clock. It's a little bit after 2, so I might push it to 3.30. Just a simple post, it's not too bad. And then I'm gonna work on something else for work, I guess. I don't really feel like working today. But we have to push through since we're working from home, so yeah. Ha, ha, ha. 